first opportunity of the day to send one into the box for the Rangers back line to deal with. It's going to be delivered into the near post. Kind of dropped it initially before Jane Ross was able to complete the clearance. And for the Rangers, there was no Glasgow City players too close by. It's going to be a corner on this near side, delivered just beyond the penalty spot. Flicked on, Lauder is at the back post, sends one back across, flicked on, header. Just wide of the target. It's a promising opportunity for Glasgow City. Reacted well to the second phase. No often any set piece duties for Rangers is gonna do so again. She places the ball. There's delivery clipped into the box. Cathy Hill meets it. Chance in there for the defender to make it. Two goals in as many games. Managed to find herself unmarked at the back post but lacked the desired power to beat Gibson. Neil Hardy's keen to get on with that as Jane Ross makes a run in behind. Ross leaves it back for Brogan Hay, clever turn inside as she finds Rachel Rowe on the edge of the area. Rachel Rowe drinks in. Rangers want a penalty and they're going to get one. Rachel Rowe cut inside the box and she had two players close by and the referee deemed the challenge to be enough to point to the spot. Glasgow City players protest their innocence. The referee gave himself a split second to think about the decision before pointing to the penalty spot. And Rangers will have a golden opportunity to take the lead. She's been so reliable scoring last minute. Winners from the spot and old firms what can she provide here with a golden chance to put Rangers in front? It's Hardy, it's brilliantly dispatched by the striker. And Rangers take the lead on the return from the international break. Rio Hardy dispatches the ball home from 12 yards into the roof of the net beyond Gibson. Expertly finished. As she continues her scoring streak in her first season in Scottish football. City to come forward themselves for the first time since conceding that goal with Atlanta. Another slack pass as Lizzie Arnott latches onto the ball. She brings the ball forward for Rangers and slips the ball down the side to Jane Ross. Cuts inside. Here's Chelsea Corner into the feet of Rio Hardy. Well held in. Lead off for Rachel Rowe. It's blocked. And a deflection takes it wide of the post. But that was good play from Rangers. They seem to have taken a bit of confidence in their attacking play from that opener. That one's loose towards Chelsea Corner. Lord up. And it's Kozak just wheeling as she seeks out Lauren Davison, her touch forward. As she's up against Nick Dobb, it's a real chance for Lauren Davison. And she equalises for Glasgow City. Oh, the ball was three, played through. Nick Dock thought she was round on the cover, but Lauren Davidson persisted. Got inside the box and dispatched it beyond Jenna Fife with her right outside of the right foot to get the away side back on level terms. To Amy Muir in the left back area. Bring the ball forward, finds her captain. Lauder just about keeps the ball for the away side. Broken here. She's done all half press the full back well and Rangers have the ball back. He clips one into the box looking for the ball for Rio Hardy. Rachel Rowe, sorry, and the ball was played across from the Wales International towards Rio Hardy. What a chance for the striker to regain the Rangers lead. It was Rachel Rowe who made the clever run and Hardy who made the spin into the area into the feet of Jane Ross. Good cover in there. By Fulton who clips a good ball down the side as Forrest is able to chase this one and is onside. Here's Lauren Davidson, the goal scorer. Davidson with a left-footed shot. Wide of the target. Well, it was more than hope. 
than anything the long ball down the side but it actually worked out for Lisa Forrest to chase set it up for the goal scorer Davison the first shot flashes wide of the target that dock cover nutmeg on Davidson and she sends it all long forward looking for Rio Hardy good strength by the Rangers striker to keep the ball there looks second favourite for at the moment Arnott comes inside, chance for Lizzie Arnott to shoot! Oh, it's a special strike from Lizzie Arnott. A goal for the ages. Well, she's certainly capable given her goal in the Sky Sports Cup final last season. And she's repeated defeat once again as Rangers go back in front. Well, the initial ball was made a ball by Rio Hardy as she looked second favourite. Rangers managed to keep it on this near side. Lizzie Arnott found it, cut inside and unleashed an unstoppable strike into the top corner beyond Gibson. Rangers back in front. Rangers 2, Glasgow City 1. Rachel Rowe will take. Tolkien across from the shot, delivered into the box. It's hit the back of Chelsea Corner and it's in the back of the net. And Rangers have a third goal. And what a decisive one it could prove to be to give them that cushion in the game. Delivery into the box from Rachel Rowe and it hit Chelsea Corner. Don't know if she knew too much about it as well. But it's in the back of the net at the near post as she was quickest to react. Rangers 3, Glasgow City 1. Lovery comes into the box, Cathy Hill was close, it's for Rio Hardy, who's worked the chance to shoot with the left foot. Good save by Gibson to keep it at three. Rio Hardy just wants a goal in this fixture. It's close to getting another there. Just see how it can switch the play as Rangers. Look to wrap up the contest on the break. Mia McCauley's going to have a chance to do just that. And she does so. Mia McCauley wraps up the contest with a brilliantly taken finish. And Rangers' second half display is rewarded with a fourth goal. As McCauley continues her fine run of form shot inside placed the ball beyond Gibson and wrap up the match Rangers 4, Glasgow City 1 